All right, so here's a scenario. You just bought your new computer, or you're re-imaging an old one with Windows 10. Put in your USB drive with, uh, with your boot image. And you get this, this error message about Windows not able to load critical drivers. There, let me, let me show you what that looks like. All right, so here's the scenario. You're just booting up your computer. You're going to select the USB drive with your Windows installation files, which I've got right here. And you've got the CD, or a CD. Uh, in this case, I've got the CD to my motherboard with all the drivers on it, and the drive. You go and you boot from your USB drive. And you're installing Windows, in this case, uh, Windows 10. I'll give it just a second here. Focus, focus, yep. There we go. Start up is set up to starting and oh more exposure. Come on. Let me just this down a touch. There we go. We can read that now. Windows setup could not install one or more boot critical drivers to install install Windows. Make sure that the drivers are valid and restart the installation. Alright, so if you get that, you'll spend a couple hours trying to figure out what the hell is going on. Because all you've done, if you've got the boot image straight from Microsoft. Alright, it's the installation straight from Microsoft. You've downloaded it two, three times. You try it again and again, you get the same thing. Let me show you what the fix is. It's utterly stupid. That right there is the fix. Watch. Alright, so we've rebooted. Trying to get it to let me select the boot device. There we go. Go back to our USB drive, which we have not unplugged. Haven't copied anything to from whatever. And there we go. We've got Windows booting up off the USB drive. And hey, what do you know? It lets you right into the <laughs> regular installation section. No weird error. So yeah, kind of silly. The fix is remove the disk from the DVROM drive. That's all. That's all you have to do. Save yourself a couple hours of frustration there. <laughs> anyway guys, see ya.